Venous stasis dermatitis, or sometimes called venous stasis eczema, it really is a form of inflammation in the skin that is very much an eczema. There's redness, there's dryness and scaliness. Sometimes if it's very acute, it can be open and oozy, but it generally is affecting the lower legs where there is venous insufficiency, where the blood return is not able to do its job. And if you go to any cardiology office, you'll see a lot of the patients, their legs are swollen and many of them may have stasis derm. And I'll tell you a story I had years ago, I was still in training. I had a patient, very nice lady who had a history of some heart issues and would get terrible swelling of her legs. And then they would turn red and tender and swollen if she had venous stasis dermatitis. But every time she'd go to her primary doctor, they'd say, "Uh oh, it looks like you have an infection. You've got cellulitis. So they put her on oral antibiotics. And of course, it wouldn't get better because it's not an infection. And they'd say, you got to go into the hospital. So this patient finally got sent to dermatology. I'm not exaggerating. She had 11 hospital admissions, 11 times. And each time, you know, she'd go in the hospital, they'd put her on IV intravenous antibiotics for days. 